Welcome to Gray on Math. We are asked to solve this problem. We have a square which has a bisected lens and a triangle is overlapping this square and a corner of this triangle is also on this corner of this square and a point on the sides of this triangle and a second one is actually intersecting the midpoint of this square and also the base is actually also intersecting the a point of the square when we are to find the area of the blue triangle okay so first thing we have to do is we need to draw a line from this point to the base of this triangle and we draw a line from the midpoint of the square to the other midpoint of the square of the side of the square and we label this as a this length and we label this as this length as 3a and this since the other side is 2a is a and this should be a also and this length should be also a okay so next is we try to find this length Because if we find that length, then it will be easy to calculate the area of this triangle one half times the base times the height. Okay, by similarity of triangles, we compare this, this smaller triangle to this larger triangle, the largest triangle, or the whole triangle. Okay, so for the smaller triangle, we have 3A over 2A, 3A being the height, and 2A being the base. And for the larger triangle, we have 4A being the height, 4A, over this unknown length we call this as b this unknown length b okay so next is we can actually cancel this a and by cross multiplying we have b is equal to 4a times 2 all over 3 so we have b is equal to 8 over 3a okay so next is we notice that this length 4a this length is actually 4a is actually the hypotenuse of this isosceles right triangle Okay, and if that is the hypotenuse, then 4a is actually 3 times square root of 2 or square root of 2 times the side. So 4a is equal to the square root of 2 times the side, which is 3 square root of 2. And a is equal to 3 over 4 square root of 2. And since we are actually finding the area and later we will see that we need the value for a square, then we need to square this value. So we have a square is equal to 9 all over 16 times 2. And we cancel this. So becomes 8. So a square is equal to 9 over 8.
Okay, so next is we can now find the area of this triangle. So area is simply one half times the base times the height. And we have A it is equal to one half times the base, which is 8 over 3A times the height, which is 4A. And we cancel this. This becomes 4. So we have area is equal to 16 over 3A squared. But A squared is equal to 9 over 8. So area is equal to 16 over 3 times 9 over 8. So we have this 3. And this is 2. So we have the area to be equal to 3 times 2, which is 6 square units. And that is our answer. So thank you for watching until the end of the video. Please like the video if you like our solution. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you will be updated for more math videos like this. Thank you. Bye.